Survive indeed, Mark Mosier. The Kings made it interesting, but Nathan McKinnon and the Avs hold on to the win. McKinnon collected a pair of helpers to reach the 500-point plateau for his career. On the other side, Andreas Athanasiu extended his goal-scoring streak to three games in a losing effort for L.A. All right, let's bring Mike Kelly back in. Uh, Mike, you know how I feel about the Colorado Avalanche. Let's talk about this victory, but more importantly, <laughs> let's talk about the man advantage. Eight of 12 goals scored by this club so far, just three games in, I get that, have been on the power play. That's 47%. What have you seen from these two units? Well, I mean, good news for the Kings is that they uh, held them avalanche power play to less than what it was coming into this game. They were over 50% before this game started, which is insane. Uh, but you look at the attempts on net percentage. They're hitting the net on 83% of their shot attempts. That's going to help you score. They get a lot of traffic in front. That's going to help you score as well. These are early season ranks, obviously, but it just shows you what's going into the success this team's having. With When I watch these power play goals with this team, we know they've got a ton of skill, LG. Everybody knows that. But they can beat you in so many ways on the power play. We saw against St. Louis where they scored half a season for the power play goals. They can attack you right off the rush for from the offensive zone they go in they score we've seen them execute with high-end skill in this game certainly against the la kings where they get into the offensive zone this back pass here by gerard to devin Taves, they did the exact same thing against the blues and scored that way um so the second unit is getting on the board with the man advantage and then you watch the skill just take over tic-tac-toe uh, you know ranton and landis got mckinnon all these guys they can beat you in a lot of different ways on the power play the LA Kings, I thought, actually played a pretty good game. Uh, the first few minutes was a, a bit chaotic for them, but they didn't allow the Avs to generate a lot with their speed, which they do a ton. Um, I, I thought they played well, but you go to the box six times against this Colorado team, and I'm sure some Kings fans don't love some of those penalties, you're going to pay for it, and ultimately that's what ended up happening, right? Yeah, definitely. I mean, great effort by the Kings, but you have to play with more discipline. But again, small sample size, it's early in the yeah. season.